Hello Vikings and welcome back to another Assassin's Creed Valhalla video. So, week 45 of 2021 and what in the earth we are doing in Norway? Well, in my live stream, Jai Mosier told me to come here because Zoraptor also did the special challenge in Norway, charging, jumping on the chickens and what I'm talking about well, this, the Unicorn Mount in Ubisoft Connect, so 25 XP and Unicorn Mount, 5 kills by charging or killing your opponents with the mount. Also, it might take some time until you are actually seeing or after claiming the reward. I ended my livestream and almost immediately after when jumping from one of the fast travel points I got this. So definitely this can be tedious one to get, but as a free mount I think it's well worth it. But let's go through remaining and one more special challenge for this week, so week 45 of 2021. The first one that we are going to do is Tom's Viking Brotherhood, so basically any dog you can recruit other players some vikings and at some point there is a limit yes we can only recruit 100 some vikings so what you need to do you need to speak to this npc in our settlement manage your crew and dismiss some of the some vikings in order to make space this quote unquote challenge is worth of 5 opals and 25 Ubisoft Connect XP. After that we are actually taking the unicorn on a spin. I have come from afar to join your crew for plunder, glory and Valhalla. So in the stables just speak to this guy after you have got the pop-up for your new mount from Ubisoft Connect. And as people told me in my live stream, this is exactly the same as in Origins and in Odyssey. But I don't care about that because it is free and did you see mini yeet? So unicorn, white horse with the horn and we hit some rainbow effects, so this is just cool. Alright, that is enough of the unicorn and let's go through the challenges. Sigurd challenge, so 50 kills using the swords. Ulf challenge, so 50 kills using the hunter bow. The next one is special challenge, the creed. And this is a community challenge, so 5 million assassinations and we get some tattoos. But we are lucky because one of the individual challenges are master assassin, so 100 assassinations to get 5 opals. And meat festival is our community challenge, so so many drinking games, 250,000 drinking games to be exact, needs to be completed as a community in one week. But because it's Oscorea festival, I know perfect spot for you to do the sword challenge, and I don't think the one-handed swords are counted, so use the two-hand swords just to be safe and also equip your hunter bow to make this easy you will get some xp pretty easy challenges and the best thing because of the oscorea festival you are getting the tokens to buy stuff so in the festival go to the lake and talk to swinda to start the hugerheim battle arena thingy and there will be three waves after repeating this you will get 75 tokens for all 
of the three rounds, but be aware this thing is bugged AF. So before doing this and if you are doing the challenges, use 200 swords and hunter bow of your liking. Of course, to just stack up your fast tokens, you can use double spears, this is deadly, this is fast and yeah. So one thing to know in the second wave of the second wave there will be a werewolf always and it is behind the tree behind the border of the barrel arena and for me it was stuck there for multiple times but you can actually shoot it and in right position you may even be able to lure it out of there so don't panic, try something before restarting everything. And yeah, there we go, level up. So the XP from this is really, really nice. But let's move on to the challenges. So if you're on old fashion and don't want to do any like save reload from the save tricks, just find any big farm area and there will be cows, sheep, donkeys, even patrols may come by and yeah, this is really really fast way of getting the kills but unfortunately we cannot assassinate the farm animals but this is something you can do besides the dailies or along the dailies or weeklies even you don't have to save, reload from the save, you can keep all the trinkets, all the leather you are getting and possibly even some nickel tungsten depends of course where you are doing this but yeah I would say this is pretty pretty solid way to get 50 hunter bow kills and 50 sword kills it only took me like 10 minutes stops and moving on to the last challenges the assassinations the special community one for tattoos and the individual one for 5 opals, 25 connect XP and after this we are taking the drinking competition I highly would recommend using Blinding Rush, Fain Dead, Torn Slumber and Focus of Nornir as an abilities when doing this but for now, thanks for watching remember to hit the like, hit the sub, turn on the notifications so you won't ever miss anything that I upload or when I go live. Also Vikings, have fun, stay safe, be strong, Scott over and out. See you in the next one and bye bye.